Tinker here. Uh, this is going to be test number three for me now for trying to upload and get the sound to work quite good on the mic. Um, as I said before, I'll probably re-upload or remake the one for the Janky Village and do more of a uh, look around and show off more of the village um, that we have there on Happy Town on the next video that I do for it. Uh, right now I'm going to show you off the Roman bath build that I did. It's one of the first builds I did on Happy Town and of course it's a water build since for some reason I'm insane and like doing water builds. So I'm gonna go through my uh, teleport room, go into the Roman bath teleport, and I'll pop out in the middle of the ocean uh, where it's at. And here we are. So, the Roman bath uh, teleport sends you right over to this small little uh, ship that I put in. Um, everything that's here, except for maybe one or two things, are quite old for the blocks. Uh, so you're looking at a build that's over a year and a half old now. Uh, so there's no corner pieces or anything uh, like the sloped pieces that you can do now in the game. So this build, where it's at, oops, um, it takes up one claim. I, I, I do a lot of builds like this where I limit myself to the size to try to see uh, what you can do or try to create in a, a one claim area so people can see it and go hey I can do that on on a public world that you're on may, maybe you're on where you might be limited for space so I have uh, coming into the garden here um, I'll go over to the Roman bath part of the house uh, first and as you come across there's a small little gazebo out here in the water and if you look down we'll be going down to that in a moment but there is an underwater garden here and so coming across this walkway here is the Roman bath uh, nice little basic build um, of course it's all mineral water so you heal all the trees were saplings that I planted in so the top part of this is actually it grew in like this and I just took out what was extra to make it look smoother and I will show you where this comes out in a moment uh, as we as we go through the house so I'm gonna go back across my pathway here and go into the house itself um, as I said, this is all old style blocks, nothing, none of the new new sloped blocks that you can ma now make, so the roof is not sloped off in any way like you can do now. So, coming on in, here's your main hall. Uh, the side over here is a library with some views of the ocean. The back side, there's a back walkway with another outside gazebo style area or patio area with lots of stained glass on the top. So we have a kitchen with a fire with some fire pits, uh, some cooking stations, of course, with the kitchen and some running water. Then we'll go upstairs to see some of the guest rooms. Um, small little garden placement here. Uh, most of the guest rooms are very basic, very small. Uh, so the first two here are, whoops, are basically um, a couple small rooms. You have some larger guest rooms here. Um, all of them do have stained glass uh, ceilings in the centers of them. And here is the master guest room. 
yeah, with and this is this one does not have stained glass. It has regular glass so you can look up and see the sky above you. Then of course we have an outside patio here on the roof. Going downstairs again. Now I'm gonna go down here. The lighting is different, and um, I do have uh, pro, but I have the light turned off so the, so you can see the better effects here. Because uh, I have the lighting in blue, it makes it uh, glow quite differently um, than if you have the light on, which this is with the flashlight on, so it kills the effect of, of the room. Um, you can see that I use coral for the basement walls, which um, I've done for a few builds where I've used the coral for the, for the actual builds. And you can see here, here's another bath area. Um, this one's lit. Um, again, mineral water. Uh, over here we have a sauna. And then, of course, if we have some sort of relaxation point or bathhouse, of course, now we have massage tables in here uh, with a small little vault. Now, the main house and the actual bath itself are interconnected by tunnels that are under the water um, that are made out of glass. See, so this is all under the water. And here is my underwater garden for the Roman bath. And as I said, the areas are interconnected. So if I come back through here, we have a small eating area. Um, that's one of the only newer items here is for the, uh, the wiring. That's just a storage area that I have locked off. And if we come back over through here, this is going to bring us back up to the Roman bath itself. So, hope you enjoyed the video. Um, so, like I said, this is one of my older builds. And I will talk to everyone another time. Tinker out.